What's up guys, I'm Suman from Phone Steen and this here is a GeForce GTX 1060 graphic card and this is from Galax. You may ask, this is a pretty old card, then why are you unboxing and going to do a review on this? The simple answer is that this card is the most underrated graphic card and this is one of the most cheapest 1060s that you can buy in the market right now which provides really good value for your money. So in this video let's unbox this and uh, definitely make sure you subscribe cause the review is coming out this week. So let's unbox this bad boy here and a huge shout out to Galax for hooking me up with this small bad boy here so small shake and here we go this is the car itself a stealth black box now that's my favorite so opening the box here we have styrofoam your quick setup guide the user manual and what's this your driver cd and uh, let's see here we have a six pin to molex connector i don't know why we have this maybe if you don't have an extra 6 pin cable or something like that you can use this with your molex connector and now here we have the graphic card itself so anything else so there's nothing else in the box so let's put that aside for now so here is the card it is definitely lighter than my zotac gtx uh, 1070 which i've been using man that is a heavy card so here we have the graphic card i mean definitely you can see they have cut corners in many places here but i'm sure they have not uh, skipped on the performance part and as you can see here this is not a really fancy card all you have is your uh, some metal like cheapo material used i think this is plastic yes this is plastic which is made to look like uh, some kind of metal but this is plastic i mean aesthetically it looks good but I, pr I would have preferred some other color or some other color combinations, maybe striking red or blue or something. It could have definitely been improved. And here we have the two fans. So let's see how efficiently they work in the review. So no problem for that. So then we have our ports. We have one HDMI. I'm th I, I'm, I think this is a HDMI 2.0 port and a display port 1.4 with your DVI connector. So simple standard nothing too fancy fancy and to power this boy we have a six pin connector so six pin so it, i'm sure it draws very less power and the back part is kind of one of another drawbacks because it is an open style back there's no back plate so there's nothing going to protect your capacitors and transistors at the back so uh, another cost cutting method so this is all for the unboxing part and uh, talking about my first impressions about this card is that I can definitely see Galax has gone a long way to cut cost but keep the performance like that. So I'm sure the performance will compensate for the lack of aesthetics and maybe availability of ports, maybe no RGB lighting also. So that is, I mean, aesthetically this card is good but not the best. So there are many other cards made from Asus, MSI, Zotac, which have really good aesthetics. So let's wait for the review, which is definitely coming this week. And uh, you can definitely expect that. So let's see how well this performs. And uh, to make this more interesting, I'll be competing this against the GTX 1070. So, so we'll just see the performance against the 1070 and how this will perform. So let's wait for that. And... If you guys like this video, definitely make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe. So thank you for watching and this is Suman signing off once again. Catch you later.